As you're looking at this project in the videos, you're probably gonna notice that there's three different basin locations. Each project is unique and each project is custom designed for each individual customer, their homes and their needs in order to keep their basement dry now and also to help future-proof their basement should any other work need to be done. Over there on the other side, we did a smart sump and we did a partial system. The reason is because they didn't want to remove all the tile in their basement and completely redo it. So we saved some tile because there's a walkout section of the basement where most of the time water is not going to be coming in. It's a low risk area. So it wasn't worth it to the customer to remove the tiles for something that may never get water in it. So as a result, we did a small waterproofing system over there, led to a smart sump. Then on the other side of the basement, we went with a triple safe system. Reason we went with a triple safe system is there's a lot of water flow being directed to one location and the two pumps is gonna be more ideal to handle that as well as a battery backup because they have all their utilities over on that side and some more finished areas this is gonna be an office, so we wanna make sure that they never get water even during a power outage. So that's where the triple safe comes into play. Now this basin location here is because they didn't do any waterproofing on this part of the house. But if they ever needed to waterproof their basement in the future, they were gonna to need to add a separate basin location because of the distance that we have from here to where our basin is and the way the pipe is pitched, it wouldn't be very easy to attach our old waterproofing system that we're doing right now into the new waterproofing system that might need to be done in the future. So we needed to install another basin. As part of the new system that they're installing in the future, the waterproofing system wouldn't be able to easily accept a basin because there's nowhere to discharge it. So instead of having to cut walls open to run our inch and a half pipe out and discharge the water away from the home, we're doing it now so they don't have to do it later. We're installing a basin right here. Therefore, if they ever need waterproofing on that side of the basement, we can run the pipes to this basin. This basin's already gonna be plumbed with a discharge line out of the home. 